smells like coffee. It looks like coffee. Geisha Akatanango. Perfume like florals, juicy body, zesty with kaffir lime, mandarin orange, and honey. This stuff is amazing. All right, let's see how amazing it is. I have to drink 25% of it before I can put things in it like creamer and sugar. It's very hot. Would you like to give it a minute to cool down? My first um, impression is that it tastes the way that coffee smells, like you always want coffee to taste, but it never does. It kind of seems to taste the way that coffee smells. This is actually a bean that was an African bean that was transplanted to Central America. And it's kind of rare, I guess. It has only a slight hint of bitterness, like coffee usually does. It's pretty good. It's really, really good, but I still have to add creamer and sugar to it. So at least I'm using sugar in the raw and whatever they have for cream out there, which is probably actual cream now in this place. But it is really, really good coffee, and I probably could power through it and drink it black. I'm just not a black coffee drinker. I'm sorry. I'm just not that kind of girl. It's okay. So add a little cream and sugar to it. And holy crap, now it is the perfect cup of coffee. Oh my god, this is amazing. There are only four sugars in there. Usually there'd be like eight to ten, but I don't need that many because of the natural sweetness of this coffee right here. Oh my god, this is delicious. Wow, that is one hell of a cup of coffee. Yum.